Today I'm gonna to show you 30 outfits you can put together with just one t-shirt, not just any t-shirt. Probably the cheapest t-shirt in your wardrobe, which is a basic tank top. But I need you to pay attention in this video because I'm gonna truly show you that not just with only one t-shirt, but with a few pieces in your wardrobe, you can create an entire lookbook essentially. But first, it starts with a t-shirt. You need a good t-shirt. Now this one, this is your cheap one. This is like your cheap paint. You can even see my nipples. Bro, I could literally tear this with one hand. Like bro, your shirt should not be that cheap, man. And if you can, that's why today, boys, we're dropping a new collection with essentials, including a new tank top that's a way thicker fabric, fits perfectly in the body, and you can't just tear it with one hand, bro. That way, with a good essential like this, you can dress all day long. Let's get started. All right, I'm gonna cheat a little bit for this one. It's a two for one, but that's the beauty of a suit. This is fit one, bro. When it's a real chill day, you put on a casual chino suit. I got the Brunello slippers. And if you wanna change it up midday, you throw on the jacket, bro. Two for one. This is why every dude needs a good suit. That's why you need a good suit, bro. I'm gonna let you appreciate the fit on this. Bro, there's ways to dress down a suit even with a tank. All right, this next one hits, bro. So I got the cargos on. I got simple white sneakers, which again, I'm gonna keep it simple white throughout. You can literally replace any sneaker you want with any of these fits. The Essentials Puffer, this thing is sold out now, so don't even try to shop for it. But the Cargos, the Cargos just dropped today, so I'm just, I'm just letting you know before they go. Come on, bro. Who says you can't layer in the summer, man? This one's easy, bro. We got the new Windbreaker suit from Essentials, and this is what I like about two-piece suits. You don't have to do too much thinking. We got the tank top underneath just peeping out as almost like an accessory. But tell me that, bro, I'm gonna be wearing this all summer, bro. It's super lightweight. It has that like retro 80s, 90s feel and it's dropping today. Boys, our launch for Essentials finally. One of the largest collections we've ever done. We haven't done a women's collection over a year. Everything's been sold out. And if you don't go right now, most of it will be sold out. And like what you're seeing in this video, bro, some of these pieces are just too good to let pass. If I were you, bro, I'd rush right now, pick up the pieces that you want and make sure that this summer, the summer you're looking good, bro, but yeah, come on, man. Tell me it's not sick, bro. The way you really stand out with a tank top, though, if you want to do it in a way where it doesn't look douchey, focus on individual pieces. For example, yo, the cowboy boots, they're well thought out. The varsity jacket, it's trending. We got more coming. This next one's super chill, bro. So we're dropping loose cut sweats, which as you can see, they just drape nice, bro. So you're, you're, gonna be, you're gonna be chilling all day. I paired it with the clogs. The tank top's still there. And then I put a zip up hoodie because that gives you the option to want to take it off if it gets real hot. You know, for this next fit, sometimes the tank can just be like a, a subtle accessory, a subtle layer that most of you feel you can't do during the summer. That's where the tank top comes in, bro. And with, paired with this polo shirt, which is a knit, dropping this April 1st, dropping today, actually. Yo, this is from Essentials. Tell me this is not a money fit. With a tank top, bro. Telling you, bro. You already know how to dress. You have the pieces in your wardrobe. You can grab the same dress pants that I've been wearing. You throw on some sneakers. Let's say you don't wanna, you don't wanna be as naked. Throw on a hoodie, bro. By the way, this is our new wool blend hoodie that's dropping also today. Tell me you don't look good, bro. Tell me this does, I'm trying to make it easy for you here, man. All right, now you see, these are super clean, bro. So I put some basic running shorts, and remember, the tank top doesn't have to be the main piece. I threw in this like almost 90 style windbreaker. Bro, like the, the, the options here are truly limitless. This next one is all about summer, bro. Something super relaxed and flowy, very loose cut pair of pants. I just kept it with the tank, and when you're this simple, it's the accessories that matter. So I layered a ring, I layered some necklaces. Good to go, bro. That easy. This is something safe. This is something safe, bro. You wanna dress up your tank top, right? You don't wanna to look too naked. Grab a full zip sweater or even a quarter zip. You can get them at Zara or H&M instantly. Easy, easy. And this is how you dress up a tank, bro. You throw on some moccasins, you have some loose cut jeans, and then throw on a nice sweater. And obviously I'm playing with the colors here, drawing from the shoes. Easiest way to color match and always look good. All right, this is my favorite fit right here, bro. A complete sweatsuit, it's just comfortable, it looks good. When it's a whole set, you look elevated. The whole sweatsuit's been sold out. This is part of our heavyweights collection. People keep asking for a restock, it takes for a while. But the point here is to show the versatility. When you have a two piece like this, you can easily layer it over a tank top or wear it at singles. 
All right, boys, we're going dark mode. So we swapped the tank, but this is just to show you the versatility. Technically, everything that I'm showing you, you could double it by just switching the color. We're still wearing the same nylons that you probably saw, and then we blacked out everything else. All right, we got the essentials, loose cut sweats again. I swapped the sneakers, swapped the tank, and I even put on a puffer. Look how completely different it looks. Also, by the way, most comfortable sweatpants you'll ever wear. Remember boys, the accessories end up making the fit, especially when you're keeping it simple for summer. So I swapped the cargos this time for something a little bit more dressier and then, bro, a nice bag. So this is a structured bag. This is the one that's dropping today. Also part of, this is part of Nav's collection. Just look how much it elevates the fit without doing too much. It's still the same tank, bro. Not for the week. This is not for the week, bro. I got 90 style jeans, which by the way, this is probably my favorite fit with denim. It's timeless, bro. It's not too oversized, not too skinny. I throw on the horse bit and yes, you see socks there. But if you find socks to be a little too much, take the socks off, it'll look clean. Now this one, I paired it with our new sweat shorts, which bro, just appreciate the fit. And I always recommend you can have a sweater that you can always throw around your shoulders. So if it does get chilly or you don't wanna be showing off too much, you can always just throw it on and you have, bro, it's like you, you got a two-in-one. You can morph midday. Here's an easy way to dress it up, bro. Get yourself a knitted polo. This full button knitted polo is dropping on Essentials today. This is such an easy way to level up a tank top. And honestly, if you wanted to go all black out, swap out the tank top for a black one, on point. Here's a lesson on dressing for the same color family. I want you to use different shades and different textures. I got, your boy has corduroy, heavy ripped fabric, and then your basic chino pant. And that, that's how you get that monochromatic look, bro. All right, here's a style move I want, I want you to do with the tank top. When you're dressing it up and you got a full button down, don't button all the buttons. Be a little aggressive with it, because it's fine. You won't look like a tool, because the tank top will cover the rest. You throw on some slippers, you're good for summer, bro. All right, this next one's dope, because most of you probably think the puffer season's over, right? Most of you think you would never wear a puffer, but with a tank top, it makes it possible. See, you're no longer hot. You get to show off the guns, bro, and anything you throw this on, especially if it's like a crop fit like this one, it's money, bro. Easy. All right, this look is calm, bro. This is your relaxed, chill look. I have cargo shorts on, so it's super relaxed. Then a zip up hoodie that I don't zip up all the way, so you can still see the tank. I have some clogs on. This is your relaxed look. This is your running errands look. I just wanna show you just how crazy versatile this is gonna be, bro. We're starting with denim, because this is, all of you have at least one pair of denim in your, in, in your closet, and if you make it a straight cut, bro, you layer the tank top underneath anything, it's gonna look good. Here's a good trick for you, bro. Obviously, when it's summer, you're going to want to use some of your jackets, but it's a little bit hot. You do it with a tank top. You put a tank top, you put a jacket over any tank top, you don't feel that suffocating. You don't feel that hot. And if it really does get hot, you just pop that thing off. Good, dude. All right, this was a chill fit, bro. This is our new stretch. This is our new four-way stretch dress shirt. I actually got it a size larger because I want an oversized fit. And then you just layer it on top of a tank top. I feel so refreshed right now. I feel so chill, so relaxed, like it's, it's airy. This is the point, boys, during summer. You wanna stay cool while still looking good. Last fit, it's, it's still luxurious, but ultra comfortable with the Birkenstocks. And I want you to notice a few things that you probably didn't catch if you weren't paying attention. One, a simple tank top, bro. Most versatile piece you'll ever wear, and we just dropped it right now for essentials. But number two, if you really noticed, I only used about five different bottoms and only about two to three different shoes. So in reality, I composed 30 outfits, and I could have done way more with the most minimal wardrobe ever. That's what we do with essentials.